Hello guys, welcome back to my channel again. Thank you so much for stopping by. Maraming salamat po sa pagbisita niyo ulit. Um, today is just an update on what we have done so far with our lattice pergola. Um, if you haven't seen my last video guys, it is about how this uh, pergola was constructed. It is just a short video, so if you do have time, um, please kindly watch it. I would really appreciate it. And also, if you're new to my channel and you haven't subscribed yet, I would really appreciate if you could subscribe and kindly also uh, click the notification bell so you can get notified of our new videos we have already um, decorated some plants and flowers here and there um, but the main thing are actually the vegetables that we planted on the sides of the pergola so we got some um, raised beds on the outside part as you can see um, we have to start with uh, we have this Patola um, in Tagalog. It is patola and I think in English it's called um, lufa gourd. I think it's also called sponge gourd. I'm not sure if there's any other name of this. But as you can see there are some blooms right there. And some patola actually growing. Um, it's actually reached the top of our pergola. So it is actually serving its purpose as well to give shade whenever we are sitting here. These leaves, they were scorched by the sun when it was really, really hot. But all the leaves, all the other leaves after those, they are pretty good. So far, not too bad. So that's the patola. And the next one is the batao in Tagalog. In English, I think it's hyacinth bean. I'm not sure if there's any other name of it, but those are so far what I know. Um, they have pretty blooms like this. And it actually has some vegetables growing on it. So this is what it looks like. This is our batao. Look at those blooms. They're really pretty, like little orchids. It's looking pretty good so far. And then on this, we got the sitao or the string bean. We actually harvested one sitao already from here. Um, but there's a lot more coming, coming up. And it's already crawled up to that point already. We also put some of this fabric here just to just kind of give it a little protection um, from the sun. Because we noticed that when it's really, really hot, um, their leaves are kind of getting scorched too. So that's the sitao. And then this is the alugbati in Tagalog or I think in English it's called malabar spinach. See, um, it started to crawl up on the lattice up to here. They look beautiful and they are delicious too. I can't wait to eat this. They're looking healthy. Okay, so that's the Malabar spinach or alugbati. And then the next one we have, some of you probably already know this. This is the Ampalaya or the bitter melon or bitter gourd. Well, from the name, it's bitter but it's one of my favorite vegetables um, as you can see it has blooms and I actually have some veggies already on it uh, looking pretty good too it actually has recovered beautifully um, once upon a time it was scorched too because uh, there were a few days when it was really really hot and uh, the leaves were scorched so we decided to also put this on the ampalaya so this is the ampalaya, guys. Okay. And the next one is the cantaloupe or melon. Um, there are probably maybe four plants in here. Um, some of them already have started to climb. So we put this to kind of help them um, reach the, the lattice wall over there. They have blooms too. It's not too tall yet, but it's getting there. 
it's healthy. Those are what we have so far around the, the pergola. So this is what it looks like inside. So that's the ampalaya right there. And that's the sitaw. And that's the bataw. And this is the patola. So I can't wait for all this plants to grow even more and actually give shade to us when we sit here in, inside the pergola so that's it for today guys thank you so much again for your time thanks for watching and i hope to see you again on my next video if you haven't subscribed don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to click the notification icon too and so you can get notified of my new videos thank you so much maraming salamat po sa inyong lahat always take care guys bye